kitchen. Today I am making a Mexican dish called burrito. Um, I hope I said that right. I'm taking corrections if I haven't. <laughs> anyway, you can make it with beef, you can make it with lamb or goat. Today I'm making it with goat. And I've been in the kitchen all day, even though I, the end result is in a crock pot, I've been prepping all day. So, if there are any Mexican friends out there that want to correct me on that name, I'm quite all right with it. If you see something in the recipe I could have added to made it different or better, whichever, I'm taking comments. So, enjoy this dish because Joe has already called me abuela because I'm abuela because I've been in the kitchen so long today. <laughs> so, join me in the kitchen for food and wine while I make a burrito. guys I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put this in here my peppers are softened because they were marinating in that broth and then we have a cup of the tomato mixture that you saw earlier and I'm gonna go ahead and put the cover on here and I'm gonna blend a little bit you know I'm gonna start off slow to chop it up some and then I'm gonna get it higher and just blend it completely okay I blended my ingredients listen y'all this smells so good 
and that's what it looks like and this is going to go into the crock pot with the goat i have the goat set aside it's seasoned with some salt and black pepper so that's going to go in with the crock pot along with this and some other ingredients so stay tuned Okay, I have my meat in the crock pot. So I'm gonna go ahead and add the rest of this. Now I did mess up guys, I didn't take out my two bay leaves from the seasoning before I blend it. So now it's all blended in. So at this point you would actually add um, your bay leaf um, in the crock pot. And that's just the rest of the uh, tomato mix. I'm gonna go ahead and put my cinnamon stick in. And, ooh, you should, look guys, look at this pretty sauce. And then I'm gonna pour, actually, you know what? Let me take this thing out. This, look, this dangerous looking thing. Let me go ahead and take that out. And put it over there. And I'm gonna go ahead and look at that, y'all. Look at that. And I'm just gonna go ahead and scrape it all out in the pot and stir it in, cover it up, and let it sit for six to eight hours. Okay, I've stirred it in and I'm going to go ahead, it's on high, and I'm gonna go ahead and cover and again, as I said, we'll let it sit for um, six to eight hours and I'll check on it every now and then so you guys just to see how it's coming along. It is now 3.30 or a little after 3.30 and this went in about, I would say about three hours ago. So I'm gonna go ahead and check for flavor and salt. Joe got in it earlier and said, that it was salt, it wasn't salty, and it was spicy. Ugh, right? Hold on, let me taste this. I think I wanna take out that orange peel now too. I'm gonna find it eventually, and I'm gonna take out the orange peel now. Let me get a little spoon so I can go ahead and taste this for salt. According to Joe, we don't need any pepper. So let's see. All right. I actually think this think it's delicious. Um I will put a little more salt on it though. This is one of those dishes that you can't salt, you can salt to taste for your own, um, you know, and it doesn't taste that spicy to me, but hey, who am I to tell someone their spice <laughs> level is not high enough, but I'm gonna go ahead and taste it after this again, and we'll take it from there. And I'll take out the cinnamon stick, and actually I'm gonna leave the cinnamon stick it, and I'm gonna take out the orange peel. So my meat is tender. I'm actually gonna take off some of this um, oil you saw on top. And now it's time to go ahead and add the honey. This is like one tablespoon of honey. I've already um, put a little salt in there to taste for me. As far as it goes, they said, you know, you can add a little more salt. And I'm gonna put a little powdered seasoning. Now you do this at the end when the heat is off. My crock pot's on warm because I'm actually, um, I am actually 
cooking the sides, the finishing up the sides to go with this. And there it is.